Welcome to the wonderful Wednesday Shave of the Day, One Video Shave. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving, and welcome back. If this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. In my last Sunday shave, Austin Housing uh, asked if I could go ahead and combine both videos into one video. So that's what we're going to do here today as an experiment. So I want you guys to give me the thumbs up if you like this format. All right. And of course, as always in the comments, you can go ahead and let me know what you think and how you like it. All right. Now, tonight we are using my... ZY Grand Slam. This is just a fine razor. Real wood scales, metal spacer. That is hollow ground and it is a good shaver. So I'm looking forward to this. All right. And then for our soap, we are using Stubble Trouble. And this is up and at him with a whisper of cool, which means it's got some menthol in it always good this time of year right now I've had that pup blooming so I'm going to pour off that bloom water and we're going to put that on his pre-shave just like normal all right mmm wonderful scent now this to me Kind of smells like a mocha cappuccino. And I just really enjoy coffee and I enjoy the scent on this one. It is marvelous. So if you like coffee, this very well could be the soap for you. All right. Now we are using my Omega 10,098. Just marvelous. And that's what that soap looks like. Now, let's go ahead and get it loaded up. All right. So, we made it to the midweek shave. Hopefully, you guys are having a good week so far. Yep. Hopefully, work's treating you well. And uh, you're being able to do what you need to get done. And, uh, it, you know, if you're not uh, working, that's okay, too. You know, hopefully, you know, you're... Your list of items that you have to get checked off is working for you, and uh, you're doing well. Yeah, hopefully you're healthy, doing well, and uh, being able to enjoy this summer. Yep. All right, now I'm pretty sure we got enough soap. Now we're going to take that, just kind of clean it up a little bit, clean up that bowl, and... Put most of that on that brush. And then what's left, we're just going to go ahead and put it on. Yeah, so thanks for, uh, you know, stopping by for the shave. Really appreciate it. All right. Here you go. Look at this. That beautiful or what? Wait till we get it going. We get our lather on. Now, Stubble Trouble comes out of uh, Texas and Adam there makes a fine soap guys really does so if you are into especially this these are vegan soaps as well so if you're into vegan soaps this may be right down your alley and he has a whole lot of marvelous scents with and without menthol so if you don't like the menthol, there's a scent for you. If you like it, there's a scent for you. Yep, good stuff. It really is. All right, there we go. Nice. Okay, now 
this is pass one, so that means it's with the grain. All right, so we're going to with the grain on my cheeks, which would be down here, kind of across this way in that area. And then on my neck, we're going to go straight down. That's pretty much in this area going to be across the grain. And then right through here, that's going to be with the grain. All right, let's get going. Okay, nice. There you go. Look at the cushion on that. Excellent. And if I didn't tell you that this was vegan soap, there's no way you'd know. Because it has slickness just like it's got towel in it. Here we go, halfway there. Yep. All right, switching hands. Now we're gonna find those and get this other side. Nice. Okay. 
Get that razor cleaned off. Let's finish this side. All right. Pass one complete. Let's see how we did. All right. Get that washed off. Oh, nice. Excellent. And really nice residual slickness there. So it is good. All right. Now, pass two. Now, this is going to be primarily against the grain on my cheeks. Now, also, I want to remind you that I do Friday specials as well. So uh, go ahead and check them out. Normally they are shave related videos where I answer questions uh, that you have and you can just put them in the comments or leave me an idea for a Friday special. And then from there, uh, we will go ahead and get it filmed for you and put it on as a Friday special. All right. And I tell you, this is how you can participate in this channel. So go for it. Just like Austin Housing, okay, he asked for a one shave video. And let's just give it a try. And remember, uh, let me know if you like this format in the comments. And give me a thumbs up, all right? And then that way I will know to continue to do this. And if you like the two episode videos, you can let me know that as well. All right. Now this is pass two. So that's going to be basically a cross the grain on my neck, against the grain on my cheeks, and against the grain here and on my chin. Let's get going. All right, there we go. Now, we're going to switch hands, get this other side. Make sure we know where that ear is, right? All right, switching that handle up.
There we go. Clean that razor off. Let's get this other side. There we go. All right, pass two complete. Let's go ahead and get that rinsed off. See how we did. Felt good. Oh yeah, nice. That is good. Oh, what a wonderful shave. All right, there we go. Now. What we're doing now is gonna be the half pass. So what I normally do is a two and a half pass shave, all right? And that's all I need. My cheeks are perfect right now, just the way they are. I don't need to do any more with them, all right? So that is good. Now, this is what I call the half pass, all right? And let's get to it. Oh yeah, nice, very nice. Okay, now this is primarily against the grain on uh, my jawline and my neck.
All right. So it looks like it may hit a little bump there, but no big deal. Okay. And there you have it. Another shave in the books. Nice. Okay. Now, let's get that rinsed off. I think we did brilliantly. Oh, yeah. Nice. Very good shave. All right. Alum everywhere. And now that's uh, astringent and antiseptic as well. So that's really good. Help close off those pores. And uh, if you got a little cut or a little boo-boo, no big deal. All right. Now for aftershave, Thayer's Lavender Witch Hazel. Really enjoy this. And this is going to be good with the soap. It really is. And again... Mm, marvelous scent. And I do put that everywhere. I really do. It's so good. Good for your skin. It seems like it even helps my hair, believe it or not. All right. And now for our balm, we are using Spice Island. And this is just a wonderful kind of sweet, it's going to go nicely with uh, this soap. So we are going to just go ahead and do that tonight for our balm. And it's going to work really good. Mmm, that is so good. There we go. All right, hey. Thank you so much for stopping by for this shave. Really appreciate you and all you do for me. Click right over here to see my latest video. Click down here on a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me. Subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.